School Days is ridiculously adorable. I probably say that about most episodes of Baby Looney Tunes, but it melted my heart. This is the first segment of the third episode of the first season, and the babies all decide that they want to go to school. But they're a little bit too young, so they decide to play pretend school. And one of my favourite moments, it's heartbreaking but so funny, is when Tweety declares that he's not ready to go to school because he doesn't know how to read or write. So he is actually boo-hooing, saying the words boo-hoo while he's crying. And it's just, it's fabulously done. And they, they learn that actually you don't need to know how to do those things to go to school because that's what school is for. That's why you're going. And it talks about different elements of going to school, such as riding the school bus. Daffy's really looking forward to show and tell. Daffy is so cute. And it's all about the different things that they can expect when they go to school. Now, I feel like the target audience for Baby Looney Tunes is maybe preschool age, maybe slightly early into school age and... It's just the ideal target audience for this topic because, you know, I don't remember how I felt about going to school, but let's face it, many, many children scream and cry at the doors of the school because they're terrified. And this can help to provide some reassurance about what to expect. And also, if your favourite Looney Tunes characters are excited about going to school, maybe you can get excited about it too. And I think it's just wonderful and adorable and so cute. And I just can't get over the image of Tweety going boo-hoo-hoo, boo-hoo-hoo. It, it just amused me so much. It's absolutely adorable. Really thoroughly enjoyed it. Even quite like Taz in this. I don't dislike baby Taz, but I very re rarely find him to be that cute. He's not one of my favourite characters, but actually in this he was rather adorable. And he started crying when Tweety was crying and it was just, it was gorgeous. A beautiful narrative, a really important subject matter for the target audience. And for me, at 31 years old, I just found it to be so precious. Beautifully animated, adorable characters, beautiful voice acting. Voices are provided largely by Sam Vincent and I just thought it was gorgeous. Definitely a really sweet, very entertaining episode with a really, really important message that can really benefit the younger viewers.